Team Oz Air kindly sent me the upgraded version of the um, Oz Air. It's actually called the Air Flex and there are significant improvements that we can see here and it sounds like as if um, Oz Air listened to me directly and guy like me in, in my case as well. So let's just read out some of the lists that they have improved before we do the unboxing. So number one is that both sides of skin are surrounded by composite backing material for extra strength and a more premium feel. Mm, that sounds good. The mask skin is much thinner to offer greater strength, uh, breathability and ease of use for those who wear glasses. So I'm actually in the same case. The ear loop design has been improved so that they are more narrow, reducing uh, the likelihood that your ears will be pushed forward, allowing for the ear loop to fit much more comfortably. Sounds good. And the fourth is the ear loop design is longer, allowing for the much more comfortable fit for larger faces like myself. I've got a big face. An optional ear loop adjuster for the uh, customized fit as well. So let's get into the unboxing and comparing to my um, previous version of Oz here. So here it goes. All right, so pretty much the same look as the um, previous version, but I'm sure inside you've got a lot of interesting stuff. So two blank filters, thank you very much. And we got the actual, yeah, I remember this. That's really nice. Oh. Okay, so I presume these are the uh, adjusted for your ears and we got a lovely pouch um, Same as the previous one. Sorry about the mess. I do carry this all the time <laughs> um, So let's fit in these two there and Move this along and see what's inside. You know, this is a really nice package every time I see it All right, look at that all these instructions I see, yeah, I see the main like difference straight away. Look at that. So I presume these valves will be the same, but let's just get the previous version out, shall we? Oh dear, what happened here? Okay, now, can you see the difference? Because I can, mainly visually from the ear loop here, but also the, the actual material finish. Because you, you would have noticed from my second video of the Oz Air, um, there was a bit of tear here and there. You can, can you see that, those tiny tear there? Um, they have actually come up with a really, oh, I love that. That's really nice. And um, let's see if it's the same for the inside as well. Well, the previous version, the original version, should we say, uh, the inner side is the same kind of feel but they have actually uh, improved dramatically on the front side so I don't think we're gonna see any of those uh, dents here that's really good I like that all right so the filters out make sure you fit in the filter and this is the no nose adjuster just so you know and um, you will hear the click sound any moment when you actually fit in the filter itself so There you go. And the other one as well. And that's all good to go. Unless you want to use the block out valve, by the way, which I don't. So the moment of truth. Yeah, that's really good. That's much better. So because of the ear loop is bigger uh, and also uh, it's thinner, it's much more comfortable on your ears. I love the material. It's, it's way more professionally done comparing to the previous one. We, we know this, there's the spongy, rather than the spongy finish, they got a much better seal on it on both front and the back. And no fogginess whatsoever, which is good actually. Um, so that's, that's good. I mean, you, you know that I already carried out a few tests comparing to the other mask. I mean, Dior's Air far is one of the best anti-fogging uh, um, mask that we have actually, I have actually tested and I'm really pleased with this upgrade. So yeah, well done Oz Air or should we say the second version which is Air Flex. Um, really happy with the improvement. Um, and like such company who looks into their issues and improving it in a relatively quick time, I have to give them a lot of credit. They're listening to their customers feedback and they're trying willing to upgrade it 
into the stage where it, you know ongoing challenges to improve it to come up with a near perfect standard which is really good and um, overall uh, yeah I can see the dramatic changes improvement so well done Aussie Air. Uh, so I hope this gives you a bit of a better insight on what has happened on the Air Flex and um, if you have any queries please do comment below and make sure you check out their website which I'm going to put down the link down below as well. Anyway thank you for watching this video this is LJP Tech. All the best Bye-bye.